Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to draw out the Lewis dot structure of NH3, commonly known as ammonia. If you forgot how to draw these diagrams, make sure to check out the video in the top right corner. Let's get started. First, we need to find the total number of valence electrons in NH3. NH3 is made up of one nitrogen atom and three hydrogen atoms. Each nitrogen atom has five valence electrons. Hydrogen atoms have one electron each, and since we have three of them, I'm going to write a three here. Adding these two up gives us a total of eight valence electrons. Next, we'll start drawing the outline of the molecule. Hydrogen only goes on the outside, so our central atom is going to be the nitrogen atom and we're gonna connect the three hydrogen atoms to the central atom using single bonds. After doing this, we can start filling in electrons. We already have three single bonds, which accounts for six valence electrons. So that leaves us with two more that we can add to this molecule. Now the hydrogen atoms have their shells filled because they have two valence electrons from the single bond. However, the nitrogen atom is missing a pair of electrons in its octet, so we can add that lone pair over here, giving it eight valence electrons. So now we've used up all of our electrons and all of the octets have been filled, so we're basically done. This is the Lewis dot structure for ammonia. In the next video, I'll use it to determine if ammonia is polar or nonpolar, so make sure you're subscribed for that. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.